This is Eric Braverman, MD for Total Health and Total Holiness for your life at Pastor Benny Hinn's ministry. The Edge Effect is one of my true favorite books to show you the edge, but most importantly, it's really your brain education Bible. You know, everybody knows how to use this iPhone, but do you really know how to use your brain? I mean, it's called a golden bowl of life in the book of Ecclesiastes, but here you learn what it means to have dopamine levels, why kids use Adderall and Ritalin, why kids end up on too much caffeine, why they use marijuana instead of GABA, how to enhance intelligence, not lead to more dope, how to sleep better, how to improve your mood, and what the effect of mood on your health so you have an edge effect. We have the most transforming information in here on the brain ever written, and it's truly one of my favorites because it shows that the body gets an edge when the brain is healthy. You have to have this book because it has a quiz that will teach you about your brain. It will teach you about the key foods that help your brain. It will teach you about the key hormones that help your brain, teach you the key medications and how to balance them with nutrients, and it will teach you a new way of brain-first life. You're already used to that brain-first or head-first life through Jesus Christ. You know, now you're getting the medical version. Get the edge effect. Help the ministry out. It is a phenomenal book. This is Eric Braverman, MD, Total Health, and hopefully adding to your total holiness for Pastor Benny Hinn's ministries. I am so excited about this book, Younger Brain, Sharper Mind. It is just a special book because it points out that you can't fix your mind without dealing with your brain. And it helps you with memory and attention exercises, memory and attention primary focus. Most people think dementia is just memory loss. It is not. 50% of dementia described in this book is amnestic or memory, and 50% is non-amnestic and not memory, meaning it's attention, judgment, abstract IQ. It's a whole host of other things. So I describe the memory functions, such as visualization. You know, can you remember what you see? Can you remember what you hear? And I describe in great detail how to improve your attention. 50% of the people or more that are driving are flunking basic attention tests. This book's going to change your life. And when you get this book, you're going to have a key understanding of your most important organ and the brain and why Jesus laid hands on the head, not on the colon. All right, so get this book and change your life. This is Eric R. Braverman, MD, for total health, for total holiness, a new path to your well-being for Pastor Benny Ministries. You know, when I wrote this book, I intentionally picked Yud Yud because I knew in the Bible that uh, Yahweh, or Yud Heh Vav Heh, or Jehovah as he's called by some, was abbreviated Yud Yud. And I wanted to think that God was helping reverse the dying process. So we know that Jesus will turn back the clock on death, the last enemy of mankind to be defeated. Death will flee from us. This corruptible flesh with stem cells and other techniques will reverse aging and we will break the aging clock. It turns out that Hezekiah had 15 uh, degrees backwards with the sundial from Isaiah and we, Isaiah, and we can reverse 15 years of life in this book. The key principle in this book that no other book will have in your life that I know of is all the different bioidentical hormones that resurrect you and how to discern what your oldest parts are. This happens every day. Someone goes for a colonoscopy, then they break a hip. They, go, they fix their hip and then they uh, break a blood vessel or they have a stroke or an aneurysm. It's crazy. But the allocation of health services is not done based on an age print or you're only as young as your oldest part. And Paul taught us that each part of the body has a role, but you have to know its role. Take the quiz in this book. You have to have this book for Benny Hinn's Ministries. This is Eric Braverman, MD, for A Place for Achieving Total Health and Total Holiness at Pastor Benny Hinn's Ministries. The Rainbow Book was inspired by the rainbow that stopped the destruction of the earth in the time of Noah, in the book of Ezekiel, and in the book of Revelation. The Rainbow Diet is that special 
concept that every day you should see the colors red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, violet. And you have to remember, it's the spectrum of visible light and the brain itself is a rainbow. There's rainbow colors throughout your entire body. Purple parathyroid, green uh, bile, uh, you know, green gallbladders, yellow and orange bile ducts, red blood, blue veins. I mean, you're talking a rainbow of color in everyone's body. I mean, the brain is gray, it's black and white. It's a real teaching in this book on how to feed your brain and body by a rainbow every day. It's simple and it's complete for your health needs and it's available through the great Pastor Benny Ministries. When I started in medicine, everybody was talking about it bypass surgery and its miracles. They were all talking about the new stents and the cardiac catheterization. Since then, our echocardiogram, our CT angiogram, and our brain-heart connection medicine, where we raise a person's mood and we raise the, the sadness and we help people sleep better and all affects the heart, has come up with a new science of how never to have a heart attack, a stroke, or any serious heart problems. Why blood pressure feeds everything in the beginning even more than cholesterol. So I wrote this book because I wanted to reverse heart disease naturally. But it was very exciting because back then everyone was talking about just drugs and, and technology for heart disease. And I said, that can't be the way to go. Well, guess what? Since then, American Heart Association and everybody's jumped on our path and Pastor Benny's Ministries offers this incredible book. But you know, you really don't, most people don't use enough niacin. They don't use enough fish oil. They don't even know what pregnenolone and DHEA and how it can affect the heart, how testosterone and estrogen can affect the heart, how chelation can be done, how brain and mood can affect the heart, how natural thyroid improves the heart muscle, how growth hormone improves the heart muscle. You gotta have this book. It's just part of dealing with heart disease every day and connecting it to Pastor Benny Hinn's mission to heal the world. This book, Younger, Thinner You Diet, is very dear to me. First of all, the YY is Yud Yud in Hebrew. It means God's diet, and it's meant to be my version of the Creator's diet. In particular, though, the work that I did with Commissioner Shah, Governor Cuomo, New York State's commissioner, proved for the first time leptin resistance as the cause of obesity. Most people are eating less as they get older. So this book's telling you why diets don't work, gives you the diet that you should do, but tells you the things that you have to do from what's called the bariatric societies so that you really lose weight. Our average weight loss in our office is about 35, 40 pounds in a year because of our work on leptin. That is the hormone associated with obesity like insulin is for diabetes and thyroid is for thyroid. We have a breakthrough in this book like nothing else. 60% of people are obese. You have to have this book. I mean, just look at yourself in the mirror. Even, the, you know, even guys who think they're fit, they look in the mirror and all of a sudden they see that sagging tummy and those fat triceps and the, and the heavy butt dropping down. This is going to remake your entire fat body into fit body. You have to have this book. This is one of my favorite books because it was my first book at Carl Pfeiffer's Princeton Brain Biocenter, which was uh, visited by George Gallup, Abe Spinell, and they actually helped make the nuclear bomb uh, for, with, uh, for the United States and save the United States from destruction by the Nazis and Russia. So that space was done healing nutrients within. And let me tell you where the book focuses. It shows you that there are healing nutrients in your body, which is the temple of the Holy Spirit. In this book, I described the new salt. I described an amino acid that cut your alcohol craving. I described an amino acid that helped you with pain. I had an entire new vision here of amino acids that raised like an Adderall, like an amphetamine. I had a group of nutrients that calm the brain. This book really was one of the first books to lay out that nutrition could not be eliminated from medicine. It had been there with Maimonides, it had been there with Jesus, it had been there with the fig poultice of Isaiah, and it's there in the book of Revelation as leaves of the tree of life. This book's a really cute book on every amino acid, the building blocks of the brain. Protein feeds the brain like sugar feeds the blood. And this is the book on protein. You have to have it. This book, was born out of my own personal suffering with my children, 
where I saw that pediatrics did not meet the needs of our kids. The vaccine business didn't take care of their bone density, didn't take care of kids' sinuses, didn't take care of their infections, didn't take care of their sleep cycle, the circles under their eyes, their allergies. It didn't take care of their posture. It didn't take care of anything related to wellness. And I said, this is ridiculous. How children are treated is a symbol of society. And more than anything, Jesus said the, the entire character of human beings is based on how we treat children. This is truly the new pediatric Bible, and it's also done in the uh, version Save Your Child, Save Our Children. I have to tell you, every grandparent, everyone at war with healthcare system needs to accept this book as part of the new pediatrics. It's going to change your life. You, there will never be a way that you'll look at how you grow your children back or grow your children up so they're not drug addicts and they're not having the health problems and the spiritual problems they have. This book is simply the guide to changing the health of children in the United States. And these signs will go before you. You'll heal the sick, you'll cast out demons. This book will help you. This book really means a lot to me because Pastor Benny and I have done so many things with it and shared it, but also it was born out of suffering in New Jersey when they basically tried to take me to the highest hill, better known as Capitol Hill, and interfere with the new school of thought of medicine, the wellness. I mean, the whole medical system is sickness oriented. They want to wait until you're nearly dead and then fix you and have the U.S. government pay for your burial when you don't need a you know, doctor at that point. You need a mortician or a priest. So this book was my entire new concept of taking the alpha Alpha to Tau, Alpha to Omega healing and covering every topic. It's simply a must in your family, but you gotta use it properly. Go to the index and use the index in the back. It's a fantastic index that helps you really follow illnesses. You'll, you'll learn a diet for virtually every health problem. And I poured out my life into the book and I have another edition for you that's gonna be even uh, another blessing for your life. It's just, it's just another special blessing so that your family is not at the mercy of healthcare system. I mean, people can go to a doctor in an emergency room, slip on a banana peel, have their appendix, uterus, ovaries, uh, spleen, 10 feet of intestine, gallbladder taken out. I mean, it's just terrible. We have to have knowledge. Knowledge is power. Our people suffer because of lack of vision. These bo this book gives you a new vision of the healthcare system. You have to have it in your home to guide you. You're going to use it over and over again. This book is also so important because cancer is a plague. One in three United States citizens gets cancer. They get skin cancers, colon cancer, breast cancer, and all of it's findable before it turns into an infection throughout the body. You got a quiz in here called Age Print Quiz. You got diagnostics called PET scans that find cancer earlier. It explains to you what cancer is in terms of immune system, why aspirin works, why fish oil works, why antioxidants work, why, why there's more cancer in women when their hormones are low, and the same with men, more cancer of their prostate when their hormones are low. This is really a unique teaching on cancer. And what's really going on in cancer is your body is developing crazy immortal cells that turn into cancer. We're looking for a new stem cell academy that's going to repair the cancers before they happen. So this book gets you going in your battle against aging and death. And don't kid yourself, the word aging just means death. All right, so you have to have cancer battle plan because most of you Spend more money on things that don't help you with cancer. You need to get PET scans. You need to do age prints right here in this book, how to do it, all right? And everyone's got a fear of cancer. I have cancer in my family. This book taught me how to avoid the prostate and cancers of my family. So use this book. I wrote this book after I read what was called the X-rated Bible, and they pointed out that Lot, Lot had sex with his daughters. They pointed out David and his uh, virgin in the bedroom with him, and he pointed out David and Bathsheba, and they pointed out that the Bible, Song of Songs, and other books had sexuality, but without it being truly healthy. 
I wanted to restore sexuality because I noticed that in nursing homes and everyone's getting old and demented that they didn't keep their sexuality. Plus, the high prevalence of adultery is because people didn't know how to use the hormones of sexuality. So we come in this book and show you, in a married couple, in loving people, how to get a sex life that is enjoyable, healthy, and sustainable. Right? There are natural Viagras, there are natural hormones, there's intensity hormones such as oxytocin that make men uh, better at personal massage and touch. The book is meant to be a holy guide, why, why, younger you is meant to be, again, a mark of Jehovah for the purposes of godly sexuality. I hope you'll enjoy it and enjoy it responsibly.